Hey users out there, welcome to this week's editions of College Hippo's Deep Dive into Master's Program. And this week we're going to talk about uh, University of Texas at Austin's Online Master's in Artificial Intelligence, also known as UT Austin. So UT Austin is one of the top ranked public universities, ranked 39th in the country, located in Austin, Texas. And this, as I said, this is a public university with a graduation rate of 66% approximately and acceptance rate of 9%. And as you can see, that's a very low acceptance rate, which is close to Ivy League's 5 to 6% there, which means it is not easy to get into UT Austin programs there. Let's look into UT Austin's online master's in AI program. This is a 30 credit hour program with three hours of core courses and 20 hours of electives. So what we liked about this is that there is so many options in electives and with the core courses, you can combine like this electives versus that electives there. So there's a lot of options available depending on what you want to specialize in AI. The total courses which you'll be taking is 10 and duration will be 24 months. And if you're doing it uh, at a slow pace, it might take more than 24 months or close to 36 months there. So that's something to keep in mind here. Now let's go into the details of the courses. What are you going to learn in there? And we're not going to talk about all the electives and the details in here, but just to give you a rough idea what you will be engaging into. It's a deep learning, ethics in AI, machine learning fundamentals, planning search reasoning under uncertainty and reinforcement learning. The elective courses, some of the examples are AI in healthcare, automated logical reasoning, case studies, natural language processing, online learning and optimizations there. Now, just keep in mind there, right? This program is uh, relatively new and it still does not talk about generative AI. So going to the admission requirements for online masters in AI, you need a bachelor's degree, GP of three or higher, statement of purpose, CV resume, uh, letters of recommendations are optional, transcripts, and the best news is GRE scores are optional. And uh, we have seen from the people's, what they've been talking about uh, this program here, that if you have some work experience, your GPA has been in good, uh, around 2.7 or three there, uh, with some basic background experience, uh it, it is uh you might get into this program there yeah, so now let's talk about the tuition the best part is the price of this program which is just shy under around ten thousand dollars which is dollar ten one thousand per course plus some additional fees so think of the total tuition to be around ten thousand five hundred dollars there which is a great price and pretty much competitive to georgia tech's online masters in ai which is around seven thousand dollars there so we think this is a great program at this price here. So we did talk about Georgia Tech's online masters in AI in our previous videos there. So be sure to check that out and then compare with this program here. If you want to see a detailed comparison, head out to collegehippo.com where you can compare both the programs side by side. And this is a great program with a very good price, but still there are scholarships also available, which is not always the case with the online masters. Some of the scholarships we have named here, there's a federal Pell Grant, and for the veterans, there is a veteran education benefits there, which means that if you have served in US military and you have a veteran status there, you might able to qualify for some additional scholarships there. Thank you for watching, and we always appreciate your feedback. Be sure to subscribe, and for more details of this program and other online masters in AI program, visit collegehippo.com. Thank you.